Hi everybody, Drew Wiley from Wiley'sOutdoorWorld.com here. In this little video, um, I'm going to show off just a couple of ways that I try and reduce the amount of waste that I'm using. Not just reducing waste, but also being able to reuse things that a lot of people maybe throw away. In this current climate with the coronavirus and stuff, I think maybe a couple of you guys out there might be able to use it, you might not. Um, but anyway, here you go. I've just made a couple of meals which I've then frozen to stick in my, my freezer. Um, so what you're seeing in front of you is just a couple of the, the leftovers. We've got some garlic skins, onion skins, bits of onion, obviously a couple of bits of carrot. Um, there's a lemon that I've used. Uh, I've got some peppers. Um, so what we're going to do... Rather than throwing this away, I'm using a Mylar bag for this. And you can see here's one that's already full, which I'll open in a second to show you. It doesn't have to be Mylar, it can be any type of bag at all. Okay. And all you do, really simply, if I can open this off camera, bear with me for just a second. Let's just simply throw everything into the Mylar bag. Or even a little carrier bag will do absolutely fine if you don't have a Mylar bag. Alright, just throw, it could be skins of potatoes, carrots, anything you're chopping up. If you've got possibly fresh basil, parsley or anything like that, you can also use that. And just throw that right in there. Okay, then stick that straight in the freezer. Then any time at all that you're cooking things, whether you're making spaghetti bolognese or, or chilli or beef stroganoff, mincing potatoes. As you can see there, look, that's one that I've just been building up. You can see I've got garlic in there, I've got peppers, um, various other bits and bobs. Just stick the whole thing in a bag. I mean, the bag's full. Stick it in a pot of water and boil it up. Okay, and when you boil it up, what you'll get is vegetable stock, just like this, no stock cube up. This is actually the beef one, just for um, demonstration. But you can make your own one of these from the waste that you've already got. So the next couple of weeks or months, if you're going to the shop and you can't get things, I think just a couple of little tricks like this might help you in the near future, okay? What you see here, like I said, I've just made a, a big huge pot of um, sweet pepper and lentil soup. So this is all the seeds which I'm keeping. And any time I use any kind of fruit or veg that's got fruit or, or seeds, I'll always keep them, stick a little label on them so I know what's what. And I've got a number of little troughs in the house which I'm going to plant. All right, guys, um, a very short video, but I hope this helps a couple of years out give you a couple of ideas on how to reduce your waste and subsidise things that you normally buy in the shops with things that you're maybe already thrown away. All right, thanks very much for watching. And if you haven't already checked us out, uh, the website's wileysoutdoorworld.com. We've also got a Facebook group as well. If you've got some questions, a really good community in there, um, please do feel free to join us. I'll stick a little link in the comment below. Thanks very much for watching, guys. See you later.